I know this group is all about mechanical keyboards. I'm pretty damn sure that this is a rubber dome. This is the best, nicest rubber dome I have ever touched. I spilled a little bit of ice cream on my uh, Model M. I usually use a silver bed, so I just wash it off the top, drying in the window for a few days. It's the lazy, quick way to do it. I've done that like 15 times, works every time. Even on rubber domes, which a uh, Model M basically is a rubber dome with mechanical strings. Uh, but this has a nice, clean, smooth, tactile feel. I don't think it was heavily used because it's still got a wrapped cord. And, uh... Uh, it's just, I actually like it. I mean, like, I'm actually, I have a really hard time getting to the tactile bump with a key not registering. It, it, it just, it snaps down and it feels good. And the CRT makes the camera flicker. It makes the fucking camera flicker. So, I, my experience with rubber domes is normally you have to slam them. And when I'm typing fast, I don't get them to register. But watch this. I'm going to just feather this. I am barely pushing it. I am trying to actually fail to actuate it. But every time it goes past the snap, it actually registers. I need to pull a cap off and see what this is. This thing's fantastic. This is the best rubber dome I have ever typed. This is better than the BTC dome with slider I have. It's 1100 degrees. Let's get this thing back on now. This is the closest thing to air conditioning I have. It's almost an MX mount, and it's, I'd say it's a dome with slider. The smoothest, best feeling one I've ever touched. Do you guys consider this mechanical? <laughs> it's close. Uh, this feels better than an MX Brown by a long shot. I would rather have this than an MX Brown. And I have MX Browns. What the hell's going on here? It looks like a foam or something. We gotta take her apart. There's some, some funny business going on in here. You know, this is gonna be a quick one take video. Oh, it's actually made in China, but. I thought that was plastic. That's, that's, that's thin sheet steel. Also, the screwdriver is of my own design and uh, over non-structurally intense parts. Oh no, I dropped it. Oh, just find the glowing rings. Oh, it's in a dark area. Oh, even better. Now I can see it even better. This thing has a real PCB? What? Oh, I gotta see what's under here. Hey. Who? The fuck's been stripping out my screws? I didn't know. It's okay, Penny. It's okay, Penny. Took a little extra force, but those uh, strip screws come out. So it is a rubber dome. Just a very well constructed one. Look at that. Well, that looks almost homebrew right there. <laughs> oh, just a little, a little round one in the space bar. This is the best rubber dome ever. Although, yeah, you know what? No, no, no. Yeah, yeah, no. The, the Model M is a membrane, not a rubber dome. A membrane. This isn't a membrane. It's a rubber dome, but not a membrane. This is actually nice. Eh, oh my god, why are you using an RGB keyboard from Walmart? <laughs> Fuck you! I've got the best feeling rubber dome ever because it's old. I have great contrast. Because it's old! I have great resolution because it's old! And that's popping up because I didn't pay this plugin that I don't even know you can buy still. Now, if only this was a full shift and backslash was right here, I would be honestly in love with this keyboard. Not bad though, and it looks pretty good. Needs a little cleaning up, but it, it's a looker. Having lock lights is nice. My Model M doesn't have that. Old doesn't mean good. After touching that and going to this, like, oh, oh God, oh, 
Oh god, it's like typing on a fucking sand sponge. Oh my god, this is so bad! This song is relevant. If you've ever shot a Glock and shot something with a decent trigger, this is the Glock trigger equivalent of a keyboard. It's stiff and it's, it, it, it's fucking SpongeBob's taint. This is a Glock trigger. And um, this is just like your basic ass double action trigger. Nothing, no, nothing fancy, but you know, it's, it, it's got a, it's smooth and has a fairly crisp breakaway. That's a, that's a good way to compare it. I mean, it's not the best, but it's nothing to complain about. Honestly, they may be selling this short. This thing is actually pretty fucking good. It, I mean, my Orange Alps is better, but this is right behind it. Don't ignore me, uh, fuck. Ignore me, I'm retarded. I meant single action. Double action always feels like shit. I know Cherry isn't exactly a high bar when it comes to switches, but I would rather have this over any Cherry. Any of them. 